Hi everybody, welcome to What's Cooking. I'm Rindy, and what we're cooking today is a treat. Didn't really have to cook much, so I took frozen waffles, heated them up in the oven, I let them cool, and now we're going to make our treat, which is an ice cream sandwich. Now, I don't know if I can do this with one hand. I sort of scooped the ice cream. I'm using chocolate, strawberry, and vanilla. I actually didn't get any strawberry on here. And I'm going to try to mush it down with one hand. Not an easy task here. I think it would be better to use uh, square waffles, which I didn't see them in the store. Or, or I might buy a waffle maker so I can make them. Now, the ideas are endless here. You can freeze these. So just like ice cream sandwiches, but on waffles. You could put, uh, I bet you could put chocolate syrup, bananas, uh, sprinkles, which the kids would love. This would be an easy thing, too, for the kids. This, this is coming out kind of sloppy because I'm using one hand. Because the stand I have for the phone, I don't know, I can't get it to record like I want it to. I have to do more practice. So I'm just going to, let me see if I pound it down more with a, with a spoon. Sorry about the noise. It's kind of messy. I, you know what I should have done? Made one that's already completed and then show you what I do. So like I said, you could put sprinkles, layer it with bananas, anything you can think of. And then just put the top on like that and press it down. And then I would clean that up around the edges. But you know what? You can just pick it up like this here. Let me take a bite. Yummy. Nice and good. So, excuse me. That's our treat. Very short video. The ideas are endless in making a waffle ice cream sandwich. You could also not put it in the freezer. And right now, on the top, you could put syrup and bananas. That would be good, too. So I hope you enjoy this very short video. Please come back to What's Cooking. Good eats. Bon appetit, everybody. And have a great night.